Flower shop, clothing, and the mirror are symbols in Pygmalion. The flower shop represents the dream that drives Eliza to Higgins's laboratory. After all, the shop won't hire Eliza unless she is able to, as she puts it, talk more genteel. It is a dream for which she is willing to transform herself. By the end of the play, Eliza has developed the manners and habits that disqualify a fine lady from earning her own living. Though Higgins reminds her about her dream of working in a florist shop, Eliza may have outgrown that particular dream and will have to rethink her future. Clothing reflects the social status of characters. For example, Higgins' <laughs> slippers represent his class as well as his disregard for Eliza. As a symbol, clothing represents Eliza's metamorphosis from flower girl to lady, and Doolittle's rise from dust man to gentleman. Eliza's father in particular illustrates the notion that a change of clothing may alter other people's perceptions. When he makes an entrance in Act Two, clad in a costume of his profession, he is happy and proud to be one of the undeserving poor. By Act Five, his unlooked for rise in wealth is apparent when he arrives at the home of Mrs. Higgins, wearing a fashionable frock coat with white waistcoat and gray trousers, dazzling silk hat, and patent leather shoes. He appears every inch a gentleman and is announced as such by the parlor maid. However, his new look is misleading. While his social standing has risen, his only gentlemanly attributes are those that have been forced upon him as middle-class morality claims its victim. In Act Two, Eliza is shocked to find a mirror in her new bathroom. She doesn't know which way to look and finally hangs a towel over it. This represents the moment when Eliza unguardedly sees herself as she is, dirty, disheveled, and far from ladylike in her personal habits. Cloaked in a blue cotton kimono, oh. she emerges looking like a dainty and exquisitely clean young <clears throat> Japanese lady. Eliza's glimpse in the mirror reveals to her the need for a change, and the results of taking a bath prove that change is possible. Thus, the mirror symbolizes self-awareness and identity. <laughs>